How's it going everyone? Med City Cards here back with another video. We are doing another chase, but this time it's my own kind of chase. <laughs> so I have a bunch of 2000 hobby packs. Um, all of these are supposed to have a Tom Brady rookie card, potentially, in each and every one of them. So that is my chase. I'm chasing for a Tom Brady rookie card. So I did pick up this Topps Chrome and I'll be, it'll be in a throwback Thursday. Um, but this this set did not have a Tom Brady rookie card in it, and I didn't know that initially, so this whole set does not have Tom Brady in it. But anyway, it's going to be something I will open. Um, there are still a couple cards I do want to try and go for in this Topps Chrome, but that's just a FYI, so in the future, I will definitely be doing that. Um, so for this video, I'm doing a 2,000 card chase, so I've got seven packs here. Um, if I find a, a Tom Brady rookie card in these packs, then <laughs> I'm set. But if I don't, I will probably continue the chase. I'll just depends on how you guys react and if you guys are interested in seeing this chase go on. Um, but yeah, they are all hobby packs as far as I'm aware. So they all say hobby on them. So you see that Fleer um, Mystique says hobby. Uh, Black Diamond says hobby. hobby. Um, upper deck says hobby. I've got two of those. And then I've got Fleer Tradition Hobby. So, single series. We're going to see. You never know. It's a um, possibility, but also very rare. Um, so, you know, it's just a chance I'm willing to take. So, I'm going to just kind of make sure that these aren't repacked. So, if it takes me a while to open them, it's just because I want to verify that they are 100% genuine in their contents and they aren't repacked. Um, so from the top half I can say that that looks real. So we'll just go ahead and pull these out and I'll check the bottom half too because a lot of times they'll do the bottom half um, but you know what we'll just we'll go with it. So sometimes these cards stick together too I'm going to pull them all apart and make sure there no one's sticking. All right. So first up, we've got a Terry Glenn, 88. Oh, got a Randy Moss. That's a cool one. 88 Terry Glenn. These black diamond cards are kind of cool. Um, it's they're, they're a little hard to see, but that's pretty cool. This is your base card setup. Um, something I always liked about Upper Deck is that they have their upper deck hologram on there. That way you know that they're actual genuine stuff. So this is going to be a PC card here. Randy Moss. I believe this is his second year. I think it's 98 is his when he was drafted. So Randy Moss 84 Black Diamond. It's pretty cool. So that's going to be a PC card. We got a Kevin Dyson. Kevin Dyson. And then we've got a Steve McNair. This is a Tennessee box, it seems. <laughs> Steve McNair. Um, then we got a Patrick Jeffers. So no Tom Brady in this one, I can tell you. But last card here is a Kenyon McCardle. It's hard to read that, but that's a Jaguar. But yeah, no... Brady in that pack. We do get Patriot, but not the not the Patriot we want. So no. Right, so I'll do the Fleer, and then I'll do I'll do Upper Deck, and then the Fleer. So I didn't check the bottom of this one. So basically, what I'm looking for is just like basically um, re-glued packs, and it doesn't look like that one was tampered with at all. So there's no glue on the bottom sides. So that one looks like it was 100% genuine. Um, sometimes some card resellers do that, hobby pack resellers. Um, it's kind of crappy, but it does happen. And they typically do it on the bottom side because most people don't open up on the bottom side. So that's why I'm going to be opening up on my bottom side, on the bottom side of these cards. So again, we're looking for a Tom Brady rookie card. That is what what we're chasing after with these cards. So we got a couch. Browns card there. 
And then we've got a Kennison traded to Bears. And then we've got a Brown Raiders card there. Uh, Tumor. Mari Tumor. And then we got Lewis. Mo Lewis, we have Matthew, I'm sorry, Matthew Hatchet. I don't remember this guy, but there's also a lot I don't remember from the early early 2000s, but it's a Vikings card nonetheless. Chuck, Charles Woodson. Cards are sticking together. I don't know what they look, what the Dom Brady card looks like, so Jeff Garcia. Sorry, I'm up a little high. That's Jeff Garcia there. Then a Jermaine Faz Fazand. I don't even know how to say his last name. And a Strike Force. Insert card. 49ers. Charlie Garner. That's pretty cool. All right. Next pack. Get a Muhammad. Sorry, these are all kind of they're kind of sticking together, but not really. And we got a McCrary, Michael, Michael McCrary. There's another Terry Glenn. Terry Glenn, Patriots there, and that's cool. Those throwback uniforms. And we got a OJ McDoofy. Interesting name. A Jake Reed. There we go. Chris Carter. That's a cool one. Chris Carter. I don't remember what his rookie year is, but. I'll start chasing for some rookie cards from older Viking players as well. Uh, Pete Mitchell. And Heinz Ward. I don't even know what the rookie cards look like in this pack, if I'm going to be honest. Uh, we got a John Ritchie. And our last card is going to be a wired insert. Stephen Davis. So that's pretty... Pretty cool. But no Tom Brady in there, so let's go ahead and get into Fleer. This is Fleer Mystique. I don't know. I like these older packs, even if it's... I mean, the, the only thing about these this Chase for Brady is a lot of the packs that he's potentially in immediately get an up, up mark just because he's potentially in it. So that's just something I'm going to have to look forward to. So these cards are thick. How many cards are in here? Only five in here, so we'll just hope 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 we get a Tom Brady. I mean, you never know. So we got a Sean King. And then our insert here. Ooh. Sparkly. Oh, that's just a sparkle card. Let's go look that up. Oh, hold on. There's a card underneath it. Oh, this is sketchy. It's a Lions card, but... Oh, that's so sketchy. So we got James Stewart. James Stewart. This is so, this, this feels so wrong. Rookie, or sorry, running men card. That's so weird. I've never seen that before. Uh, maybe you guys will have to let me know about that. That's so odd to me. 
But anyway, <laughs> running men card. And we got an Eddie George. Jerry Rice. Jerry right there, yeah. When was his rookie year? 85. Man. Jerry Rice. So he was still in the league in 2000? Crazy. And we got a Terrell Davis. So he was a 94, 95, 95 draft. So, not too shabby. That's an interesting insert card. That's an interesting way to do an insert card, if I'm to be honest. It seems odd. Anyway, last chance here is three packs of Hobby Fleer Tradition. And you never know. I see a Favry. As I, I got a rookie card Favry back there. I got a rookie card auto of Dalvin Cook. And a rookie card auto of Mike Zimmer. Yep, head coach of the um, Minnesota Vikings has a rookie card from Coach's Ticket or Contenders 2016. So we got a Fighting for the First Down card, Tampa Bay Bucks team card, a Kwame Cavill rookie card. Um, we got a Rookies to Watch. In gold. Looking for a fourth straight victory. Patriots. That's not a real auto, is it? Jerome Pathan. No, those got to be fake. Printed autos, right? I would assume that those are printed autos. Andre Ryson. David Hard, Dolphins, Sean Springs, Akili Smith, and Brett Favre. Brett Favre. So nothing there. I'm hoping, hoping, hoping we can find that Brady. So we got RJ Sauer, rookie card. Rookies to watch, Ron Dixon, uh, Marcellus Willie, Brad Johnson, played for the Vikings for a little while, wasn't too bad, Greg Clark, Tony Richardson, Chad Bratzik, Bratsky, uh, Jamal Anderson, Kenya McCradle, and an Eric Moulds. Last pack. Come on, Brady. This cost me way too much money to not have a Brady in it. But that's the gamble. It's the gamble you take when you buy these packs, so. Alright, last chance here. Ike Hilliard. Hilliard. Ike Hilliard. Got a Darren Howard rookie card. And Jonathan Linton. Linton, rookies to watch, Travis Taylor, Stephen Burellen, Burellen, Jermaine Faz, Faz, Fazande, Stephen Davis, you got Robert Griffith, that's a cool card, Ed McCaffrey, and Kaderi Ismail, Ismail, no Tom Brady, but again, it's a gamble you're taking. But you know what? That's all right. So yeah, that that is it. You guys will have to let me know if you want to see this continue on. Um, if not, then I'm not going to worry about trying to find any more packs. Uh, these are all I like, that I could find um, on eBay for a decent price. So um, I just thought maybe I'd just give it a shot and see how it works and see if you know maybe some people are interested in this kind of stuff and. If you are, then I will definitely keep going with it, and I'll keep searching for that Tom Brady. Um, I just know that I can't dump too much money into it, because, you know, it gets expensive after a while if you can't find it. Um, so I know the chase is very, very difficult, but we're hoping that we can maybe find it. I don't know. I'm waiting for my graded card from this guy. This was from the Contenders Rookie Auto Chase. 
we'll be getting that in hopefully soon. Um, I know it's um, in the mail. It should be here Monday. Um, today is Saturday. Um, and yeah, I think that's all I wanted to say. So if you guys have um, any suggestions on who I should search for or any chases I should do, that would be great. Go ahead and leave them in the comments. Otherwise, you can just let me know if you are interested in seeing more of these, um, you know, throwback kind of packs, but also a chase for um, a nice rookie card. So you guys will just have to let me know on that. But anyway, you guys, thanks for coming out to see the video. I do hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you in another one.